I have some roasted flesh. The 15 questions about the first 10 months. Foreigners marry. Your foreigner and foreigner. Two foreigners. Foreigners. This is 10, 15 questions about marrying a foreigner. And this is what it looks like after 10 months marriage. First question is. Oh, wait, 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 we gotta get our. Oh. Dingy, dingy, dingy. First question is Name, where are you from, and how did you meet? So my name is Jason Pritchard, and this is my wife Parita Pritchard. Where am I from? I'm from Canada. I cut down trees, I eat my lunch, I go to the laboratory. On Wednesday I'll go shopping and have buttered scones for tea. And you are from Finland. Eastern Finland. How did you meet? We met off of an online platform called Christian Cafe and they want us to make a video for them because we met on their platform and apparently it's successful. <laughs> I'm having this apparently successful. <laughs> According to the algorithms of platforming. Question number two, when did you get married and how long have you, married? Have you been married so far? We got married um, 2016, June. Yeah, about 10 months ago. What did you do right after your marriage? Our wedding? Like we're still married. Oh. <laughs> we died and went to heaven. <laughs> Hello. It's nice up here. What did you do for your honeymoon? We traveled to Canmore. And my parents bought us a honeymoon and went to Canmore which, if you don't know, is a really, really beautiful place in Canada. Very After that, we were really into tiny houses at the time. We talked about investing in a trailer, and so we bought a 1977 Triple E old trailer that was rebuilt. I thought it would be a cool little project to like paint it up so that it looked like a dinosaur. We wanted to do something special with that trailer, so we took it back to the Okanagan. We went to Golden, BC. What was the next stop? Those names were just so weird to me. I'm trying to remember. It was, it was the, the skateboard park. Oh, really? That was the second one? So the next stop we went to was Coldstream, close to Vernon, BC. So we slept outside the tr we slept outside the trailer, <laughs> not in the trailer, right outside of it on the ground. We slept outside, but in the trailer. <laughs> uh, inside of the trailer. Inside the trailer. <laughs> <laughs> that was weird. But inside the trailer. But inside the trailer. <laughs> I remember something happened. The next stop we went on our honeymoon was Penticton, and that was probably our safest area. We just parked in some by some tree. Then we headed up towards Vancouver. Run. What our goal was to go to Tofino, this hippie town that everyone talked about. <laughs> because it's my nap time. <laughs> We drove up a big hill and the truck kept saying like a warning happening, like there's a beeping light going off. We found a truck stop, we took a nap, and we realized like we should go back because the truck's not doing so well and I think Your was, wife was doing my so wife well. wasn't doing so well. And, you know what? We'll go back to Tofino one day, but let's go back to Canada. Calgary. Calgary. That was our honeymoon. But we did have another honeymoon. We decided to fly back to Finland because Jason had not met my family yet. We found this cottage that my parents own and we could stay at the cottage for four months.
was so peaceful and it was amazing beauty of nature there and we could have the whole big huge cottage for ourselves except for a little moose what was his name billy we only had one neighbor i think he was a useful moose